Okay, this is my O2 Dodge Neon, and I'm going to be changing those spark plugs, which is actually these four right here. And then right here, I got the um, spark plug, which is actually Iridium, recommended for my type of engine. And also the NTC lubrication and the electric tune up grease, along with the um, spark plug socket. The first thing to do before you actually change the spark plug is to actually unplug the negative side of the battery so there won't be any shock or electrostatic problem. Alright, so after unplugging the negative side of the battery, then you can start working on the spark plug. So all you have to do is pull these out. And the spark plugs are inside these right here. And then you're going to be using one of these long socket, spark plug socket, to pull it out. I right, got that, that spark plug, that spark plug, and that one. And this is the last one right here. Alright, so these are the four spark plugs that I took it out from the engine, and look at all these black burn dusting. So by the look of it, it looks like carbon burns, which is caused by the air filter. And there's actually that right there. So I'm going to replace these right here. So the first thing I will do will be putting the de electric tuner grease into the spark plug booth. Just put some around this thing, and along with the other. Okay, so I got some de electric grease into all four of these plugs. Now to work on the spark plug. Okay, so I'm going to be using this um, gap gauge right here to measure the gap for the spark plug. And then I just had to make sure that this is between 0.83 and 0.96 millimeters for the spark plug, which is actually recommended for my engine. So the way to do it, all I had to do is put the gap right here between this right here and make sure it is between 0.83 and 0.96 so the next thing I'm going to do is add some NTC lubrication to the spark plug so basically I'm adding to this part I mean this side of the spark plug so basically all these right there after putting some NTC lubrication onto the front of the spark plug I'm going to put the spark plug back into the engine where the spark plug is supposed to go so I'm just going to put that into the socket Put that back into the socket hole. Okay, so after I put all the spark plug back in, I'm going to put all the boots right here back in too. Last of all is to put the negative connection on the battery back on. 